you guys hey guys um today i'm going to show you guys how to do this awesome cute hairstyle on american girdle and uh, you guys can't see it and i'm using i use samantha as like a little demo for you guys this is looks like from the front and back i really like this hairstyle it's one of my favorite hairstyles that i've ever done and uh you guys can already see how i did it but still, I'm going to do a demo. So here's the aftermath. So I'll use Samantha, and you want to use a person with long hair. Probably this is the um, length they want it to be. If it's shorter than that, I probably can't do it. But it's like that much shorter. Yeah, go for it. But it's like up to here much shorter. You can't really do it. So definitely do not use Kit. Her hair will not work. So, and for today's video, I'm using a doll with even longer hair, Sage. And here's, she looks like she does not have thing in her hair, and I just cleaned it, I softened it, and it's really, really pretty. So, what you're going to do is you're going to take the hair that, like, is mostly in front of her head, like, this much. See the hair? Like, can you see what I'm talking about? It's like the hair that's in front, and then there's also the hair that's like back. I'm pretty sure you guys know what I mean. <sighs> Just grab a front piece and start to braid it. Um, if you guys don't know how to braid, um, I'll leave the link in that video that I did. Um, on how to braid or how to do a braid so if you're in the beginning and you don't know how to do a braid you can go click that video it's the link is gonna be in the description down below and uh, um, first thing you want to do is it helps if you wet the hair so kind of damp it but since I cleaned her hair um, But since I already cleaned hair, I shined it up. Um, sadly, that video begins to feel transfer again. I'm going to try one more time. That feels transfer. I will just tell you guys all the ingredients you need and what you need to do besides the demo of me actually doing it. I'm probably just going to do that instead. So what you're going to do is take that section, brush it out, wet it. Let me just show it the supplies you need. So, hairbrush, this, and some hair ties. I need to go get some hair ties, so I'll be right back. Probably you need free hair ties. So, I'll be back. Okay, so I have the hair ties. Got the different colors. And this is from Labor Loom, but we use them as hair ties. Since we have nothing else to do with them. Again, brush it out. It needs to be really straight. Again, do check out my video in the description down below if you guys want to know how to braid. What you're going to do is just braid the section on the back once I do that. Okay, so after you have braided it, there's my braid. I just probably can see it. Just take a hair tie and tie it off. And it should be really easy on how to tie a hair tie. Oh, yes, you know how to do that. Okay, so there's one braid, and then you're going to um, take another section of the hair. Then just damp it and wash and brush it out. And do the exact same thing that you did on this side to this side. I'll be back once I do that. Okay, guys, so I'm done with the braid on this section. This took me about, um, to be honest, about five minutes to do both braids. What you're going to do is you're going to take the hair that you haven't braided and brush it out. And it's really important that you only do the front sections because, yeah, because 
Because, yeah. And then what you got to do after that is take the two braids and lay them just like this sideways. Pull them, wait. Pull them back. Pull them sideways. And pull them back. Just like that, so it creates that kind of shape. You guys know what I mean? Again, take the two braids like this, pull them back. I don't really need that big of braids, try not to do the whole thing. And then, depending on how big you want it, I'm probably going to it about right there. Take another hair tie. Preferably one that's actually stretchy. And just tie it. Make sure you try to get all the hair out of the way when you tie it off. And then you're going to take off the two hair ties that you're using before to hold the braids secure. Undo them. Probably the braids undo really easily. Pull them off. And the hair tie should keep the braids from falling out. Let me tighten it real quick so it can go up. There we go. Now that's how you do that cute or doable hairstyle. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. And see you next time on Supergirl 101. Bye! But I love you guys to the moon and back. And see you next time on Supergirl 101101 for another for some other awesome videos. Bye everyone! Love you all!